Hello all. Yeah, I uh, play it again. <laughs> Just it kinda happens. <laughs> and then caught up in reading. I never know I only a paragraph or two left, but it kept going and I'm like, nope. Nope. Shame that most of the watery areas have been done by this point. but I'm gonna try to get some more hardy okay, I don't know if they uh, respawn or not. It's been so good to have one of those exploring water areas. I don't think there's really any left. Oh no, I think there's one area that has a ton of water. That's probably a ton of water. Barrel. And, I, and I've got more of this area too. Pretty sure all these are probably. So. Thank you, her name is Mufa. Oh, do I know? I do that I can take a break and do insights. I don't even think there's a lot of waterfalls to go up. It's a real pity I just can't make you lose ever. <laughs> It's neat armor. <laughs> Anything that else that I've been done there watch watch the fight. King and Fusion, the future generation. The link is future generation mm. link as well. Same thing as last time.
The best way to look for whoever the wife went is just thoroughly search all of the knots. Okay, so dumb decision was dumb. Likely to be washed up here, but still. Interesting how big a boom those explosive turtles do. Yeah. 
Let's see. Quest I've been talking about keeps just even more interesting to get. <laughs> Some little interesting things that are not no important, like uh, <laughs> the, the, <laughs> the ones that are firmly based on uh, Warhammer Fantasy Can and just never got used for anything. I mentioned Sylvania before, but, but uh, Sylvania you, was originally a home to the Venonan tribe, who had their bo various different bog gods they worshipped. Well, occasionally a vampire just ends up uh, falling within a march for a bog or, you know, a swamp. Sinking into his staff, so they've never seen from again, even though in setting it, they don't stay dead. One of the explicit points of being a vampire is that no matter what they do, they will come back. Eventually. Can't really do much to stop it. Mountain's edge. Get a look around here. Uh, but yeah. Like in Canada, a pretty nasty vampire of unconscious state got taken down there and never seen again, it's despite the fact that legions of vampires have been digging for that swamp to find his remains to uh, bread them. He's not exactly the kind of guy that would just. Here for me. Like that. That something. The original Long Con style. Dracula analog. Didn't mess with this one particular village. You and he took over. And they openly defied. And when one of his successors decided to uh, change that, they killed the vampire he, he spent, tossed his body into the swamp, and again, never seen again, never troubled. So, Kim and I took the washed away mission before. Downstream for the one thing. 
about to get washed away by somewhere in here or somewhere in here. Definitely not in the spots I'm looking at right now, but... I potentially could have gone all the way here, and I'll have to check the, the wall. Waters and Zero, I think. Maybe. I'm going to blow a higher than that and going down that path again. Uh, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> That's just a, a little neat thing from Warhammer or Fantasy Cannon. I never got anything done with it. Uh, something more is not a more. A fin is in a fin, and so on and so forth. But yeah. That's what I got stuff. Wow, wow. Oh, much shit. <laughs> okay. I hear a deal with him. covered the fact that, uh, other shit, uh, the player character had been gun recovering, uh, Richard's supplies of their old boss and daughter after she got fired. It's like her slaying the vampire who had been in charge of her. I think in charge, but... The particular head vampire who was making it his big goal to uh, harass her. And I was just really building a, a school of necromancy. But that normally is done for necromancers, but this one. You go. Fucking. Good, it's gone away. But yeah. After that, helping out with the war song, getting some battle with those called in to really help with it. And some rolling away, they became friends. trying to cover all the stuff I, I didn't cover what that time that's happened since then. Uh, uh, that character settled in the role of lore monster of Karak Eight Peaks. At the time still missing uh, the uh well other uh five peaks 
Hello, uh, Valeria. Just, uh, sorry about a Warhammer Fantasy quest. Divine loyalties. I, uh, been reading up on. And... Fully exploring this area. At least, mostly. Fine. I was the game just trying to find any signs of potential shrines. More likely signs of Koroks and maybe one or two uh, quest related things. And the shrine is what I had before, but hey, it works. That's okay, let's see. Monster bits. Items. Sign of any shrines or crocs on that. Could be on this peak here, though. They like that on Lone Peaks. Oh, yeah, that. Players managed to at least somewhat explore one of the, the, the mystical mumbo jumbos they've accumulated but didn't understand for a very long time. Eight in game years they sat on that. <laughs> Oh, well. I don't need that item. 
I'll find another one. I'm gonna swap it out with real quick. Let's see. Ah, yeah. My instinct to write. It was indeed. Indeed, a yeah. Pop this thing open and. Slightly different way today, kids. And eh, minor issues. Be sorted out later. <laughs> now, the question is would this count more towards a Nago Bridge or. Okay, let's see. Oh, uh, not a Kayla. Uh, oh. Find, find, uh, find where the Naru is on this list so I can. Yeah, that's not it. No. 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 Woodland. No. Central. No. And bring it. Uh. There we go. Uh, now. Location wise. Definitely wouldn't call out a plan, Zorana. Game isn't marking anything as in uh Dora's uh river, so I'd probably put that next to Nago Bridge then. Yeah, Nago Bridge. Flex doesn't have a Zora River. Case. I go. I go.
Give me a bit, folks. North Naga Branch, what it was listening under. Okay, let's see. Well, that takes care of this area in this area. side and uh gosh oh there's something i need to do uh i, I will float down to a good spot and then go do that Got the mission thing here. Okay. I uh, was not expecting to find a broken texture spot in this game, but... Huh, I've never heard of something like that in Breath of the Wild before. 
get the, this one little area that I forgot to uh, put the tech rock texture on it. <laughs> That's just the rock texture too. The wall on it and thus boop 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 boop. This part here is some of this part is perfectly seamless, but Expecting that to happen when I, I ran into this thing. Fixed. No, it's not. Never mind. That is weird. That's the game is so fine. I honestly was not expecting to have a little bit of, uh, Jump, broken uh, world geometry there, but huh. yeah. Big cool switch that uh, the blood of a uh, warp entity. Uh, oh, I say blood. The material that makes up a warp entity that, that is Sion stuck in a weird portaling thing, resolving in a bunch of mirrors, out of which they travel through. Of extremely close proximity to each other. So they're basically going through portals that are overlapping and blah blah blah. Point is, it's. It's just turning your cat snake, basically. This is obvious.
back. God damn it, take the fuck over there. Trying to uh, see if I can. Ah, uh, no. Never mind. Find that uh, ruby. Mark it correctly? I, I, I feel like I did, but I can't find it. Yeah, sir, sir. Fuck it. No, no, here it is. I have to come back there at some other point to see if that's still there. It's not surprising, a big game like that, missing one spot. Especially since, uh, all I can, uh, say to the game, you, you actually are supposed to find them over basically all of this and explore it. Starfields, the, well, mixed things on the one hand, you use a lot of playing uh, those games in general. Not that they don't have at least somewhat of a point, because it's a pathetic. I love Bethesda games, but I'm a Bethesda games, but I'm also pulling the rolling what I meant. They, uh, they, they're kind of shit in a lot of ways. They're very good in other ways, but they got a lot of issues. Let's see, let's see. It did, did it, did it, did it, did it. There we go. Boop, boop. tuning yourself to to it. Oh 
those other mages will generally keep on trucking if they've been mutated enough by their winds, but that also just means you have to your time ma mastering it. Just means that, you know, they can't do anything like, say, since stop actually reading the in-between stuff in, in the thread and since uh, there is a lot since uh, there's a lot of posts and it was around the point when uh, there was a shit ton of rapid fire posts with only a little bit of information and I really wanted to just read more on the page I'm streaming and not uh, you know Pull through the bunch of red stuff. Uh, that wasn't really going on anywhere yet. I feel like I got turned around there. I definitely feel like I got turned around. Unfortunately, it seems that one of the first plans just straight up just didn't get involved enough to try to manipulate it with another wind. Like, what do I mean, like you would dar, but you know, that stuff, but curled into sickly wrongness. things might be the natural state of things and the other might not so who knows uh, but <laughs> but those plans may or may not uh weapon smoke when uh discussion about using the, the the guide on how to do that stuff got very heated a lot of people were convinced there was a it was there was absolutely no benefit this bike. It would actively be too dangerous to learn anything from it, and we would automatically be tempted to evil or something. Even though it was outright said it was not going that the only way you would it would be the play it would take the players being tempted towards evil for evil to happen. Because the person who made it a, I'm a genius. B, not actually trying to fucking make a corruptive artifact.
<laughs> Good. Give me all your arrows. So it became a, a topic that was not allowed to be discussed. And it was decided to vote for it, and then one, once it was voted, it would be an automatic action with no rules or any of that stuff. Because, as far as I, I, I can tell, anyways. Maybe there were, just not nearly as many. And absolutely no, should we continue? Or, no, no, in fact, no voting on actually doing it, because, you know. That would just be inviting a relitigation of the order, and that's not the one they wanted. A few uh, quests can't have that problem for. Probably the worst is for Yona from. Uh... The uh, Madoka quest. I forget what exactly it is. It's kind of because it's. Yeah, Paula, Magi, Magica, Madoka, uh, and all that. But it's like said that, but break something, something out of the go. System. Breaking the system. It means breaking the system. Swap that for my uh, area. I have a dam in the road. Ooh, that's a new one. Some useful stuff out of it, yeah, after the arguments are over. Oh, right, Rio, I was. Uh, basically, in, in, in that game, it's just breaking the system. Uh, I don't know what a. I don't even remember what Soul manipulation powers and. Had a habit of group stealing and enslaving the souls of others. Choose 
was also just a giant fucking asshole. And while it became quickly apparent that she may or may not have had some, some uh, sympathetic stuff, reasons for what she was doing, it was, yeah. It nearly drove the, uh, the person running the game away from how heated discussion was, and so when the f Fred finished what they were doing, which was never sold him, put her on ice, and basically pretend that none of that ever fucking happened. Narratively, the giant, it's a giant black mark on the quest, narratively, but it's also like, no one wants to real, the gym is not willing to, to uh, oh, let, uh, any relitigation of that shit happen. For understandable reasons, but it's still, yeah. It's, it's unfortunate that, you know, there's no real... It's not something that's obvious when you're just reading through the Fred Mark, so... <laughs> uh, anyways, back to... The other one I was talking about, the, uh... a little spring, but nothing good. Something cool. If I could have pulled it off. Boom. here before but I'm gonna take another quick look around <laughs> the rocks had loaded in Oh, 
need to let it fall all the way over here, bud. Let's go there. Oh yeah. Okay. They did manage to eventually find some oh. Something to do with it. At least I've gained some better understanding of it. Now I know. Exposing to any significant amount of but, uh, chaos is really turned to chaos. They make very effective bombs. Because it operates, you know, you just look for magic operating on the road, you the free stance of matter. Being the liquid state of matter. Explored there, and I already explored all around there, so. Uh. understanding you know, the properties it works under workspace scenarios and all that is helpful. Yeah, but I find that the only little use use that has been discovered with uh And that's, it allows a uh, spent uh, anvil of dune ruin, which, unlike most, is not inscribed to an object, but attached to it. Be rapidly recharged. As such, uh, 
His system is basically created. He needs something from a runesmith. This shit's worth uh, two favor per ruin. I do two gallon you get. And you get a gallon. They get about a gallon every three months, so. They actually had to use that for an interesting thing to make, make a room that was extremely good at taking magic from dangerous miscasts and uh, diffusing it. And, uh, and I had them built in every, uh, Cocoa Hills, uh, in every one of the different colleges of magic. That combined with the boatload of papers on all the shit they were studying. Most importantly, uh, during a raid, coming back with a Skaven prisoner. It's important because it, it is pride because Skaven had spoken uh, the language of the dwarves, which the main character had picked up on after, you know, living with for so long. And, uh, had promised his servitude. Now, of course, you never trust Skaven. But, well, you can't trust a Skaven not to backstab you. Whatever's in there, I need. Do that, do not have. So. Did a major help, especially when yeah, I'm free training the local uh, human beings, the uh, battle mages. But yeah, uh, right, yeah, escape, escape. I'm just talking about escape. Uh, well. Mark off and help the lake. Help the lake. Yeah, I'm going in the next side. I probably will, I think, turn in early, but I still I want to do at least some more and keep talking. Keep talking.
I thought the players were very good. Uh, when it was first introduced, it was obviously intended to be a player thing for the players to get all of it because, well, the players were, uh, you know, surfing in a place called Sterling, and now working for war. Outside of the city, I don't know where thing is going to be extremely rare and hard to do to get in favor. Uh, By this point, the main character has probably become one of the, the humans most likes of most like humans in the history of the Empire, or the second most. <laughs> As Sam. Shine of the sun on the water. I thought it was a very like circle about. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, that's obvious. Dr. Harris. Sasha Haas. Well, I think I've done that. Yeah. In this yeah. general area before, but Second only a Sigma, founder of the fucking Empire. And the guy who made it got in order to do a lot of really good things for the Empire by helping them out. To find what now to find what the dwarven hit. Now let him carry the dwarven hammer. They let him out. Uh they made the ruin fangs. They don't even like doing swords. Hmm. <laughs> 
Oh, we got Yeah, I noticed that. Yeah. But yeah, I got a bunch of really high quality swords to be used as the sign symbols of office for different, uh, Okay. <laughs> oh, uh, Millennial Sandbox. Right. Right. Hey. Uh -huh. There we go. But yeah. Uh, let's see. Amongst the things. Amongst the things. What else? What else? What else? Actually, hold. I'm probably better just going this way. What else? That's it for the Ethereum anyway. The, the players also got. Uh, we're given the option and led to believe by multiple posts, both in, in, in the story and out by the. Him, that uh, it would probably be a fruitful course to action. Search studying the divine. The uh, coin gifted to them by their good old buddy, dearest friend, Ronald. God of, God of uh, the Night Prowler, Protector, Fever. Uh, and I forget the last one, but gambler. Got of seeds, rebels, uh, noble, uh, protective lords. Noted in game multiple times as one of the few in, in university entities that, that will always answer your calls, even if it's just tying your shoelaces laces together while you're distracted. To watch you to laugh when you fall flat on your face. Main characters a de devoted father uh, and help them out even by uh, taking advantage of the situation and to help him uh, steal a chunk of power from good old of work and work. Work out. I'd like the first time he said something like that. Since it, 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 the major thing is he's, you know, he's a god of thieves. Take a wild guess. How he, got, he became a god. Getting more of them, they're probably over here. Pretty sure there are more of them. 
There we go. Take that versus the mask versus the mask. Huh. Oh, Zora over there. That didn't go well because it turns out it was inevitably going to be a normal despite being actually good friends. So, now, mind you, unlike most gods, I uh, don't know no, was a rather gentle uh, rebuke. And it was an amusing way to handle it, you know. You do study, first studying the coin and how it does it, then at least a little bit, then look. And study their god in the died realm. Give the students the house on things like that work. Only to be interrupted by delivering a message for Matella Weaver. From Ronald. So I was to my dearest friend. Sincerely yours, Ronald. The, the O is small. It looks like an A. And the rest of it is... is there, there's more room there. But only don't is, uh... Legible. basically made it seem like it, that it would be perfectly fine from out of character posts and then got offended when people were kind of upset at that. Like, it's not my job to stop you all from uh, getting excited over uh, and invested in wrong paths. Yeah, to maybe don't, uh, Go out of your way to lead them down that path. Huh? Normally, he was fine, but then, then, then that one was just, no, dude, you, 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 you huh? absolutely were not done. Uh, right there. <laughs> no way it, it stands for fun to that. Huh? Okay, I was a lot more huh? quiet about it than I was. A lot more. I would, like, I would be, I haven't played the game. I, I would be, is what I meant to say. I got my tenses mixed up there. Yeah. But yeah, uh, 
That one just rubbed me the wrong way. Even that's me being nicer than the way I could have five flames. Okay. I think I'm big, uh, um, understanding here. I need to get that thing pointed down so I can lay it all on the fire. Oh. I thought that, uh, I didn't think it's paper. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oop. There was a ton of neat stuff happening in there. Things they were allowed to do with the quick the, the, the skating. Uh, yeah, for some reason, when you're, you just post a uh, emojis, it doesn't get picked up by my thing. Sorry about that. Uh, I can't I even see your name in the uh, stream chat. Oh. 
Well, that works. I mark that one off my list, and after I take these guys out, and then I, I think I'll wrap up with these guys. But yeah. Gave in our a nine infinite storm of rat men. Constantly stab each other in the, the back. Who, who would uh, almost certainly be able to take on the entire setting if they weren't too busy stabbing each other in the back? In fact, they have on occasion done just that. The biggest, of course, being the end time events that uh, the Roman Time games are based on. And yes, Roman Tide as in a tide of them. That's where we're heading to, like, Zala. Yeah, just as far as the story. Basically, yeah. Nobody under- And one of their biggest things, nobody understands what the fuck they're saying. Also, in the base setting, everybody arbitrarily forgot they exist, even in spite of the fact that one of the emperors is literally tied in the title of this game as player. But that, that's one of the dumber rights. This one goes, everyone's pretending. Most people don't know how to make this because there's a conspiracy to make this game and think they've been forgotten about, so they don't feel fun enough to clean up their act and actually start fucking cooperating. Situational based knowledge in their head and then have it just unlock it when you're in a situation where you need it. Yep. Which had a delightful bit of complication, but uh, yeah, they found a quarter of a sort of shame, shame, escape. Used their magic artifact gifted by their god. I'm gonna look at this beat just since I don't want you now. There's a thing over there. I'm gonna go ahead and complete that. Oh. And knock both of these things off the way. I, uh, go do it, uh, but, yeah. After manipulating the thinking that the Great College, at least, are in the ad, knows how to, uh, translate scheme, but, uh, it's expensive, and the people doing it are hoarding it for power. So why don't you do me the favor of, uh, I just translating them for me instead. And of course, this all makes perfect sense in their scaven logic, so like, oh sure, yeah. With a few deals, including, you know, more book games on a, a particular form of in universe monster that are fascinating with, and then later. In exchange for teaching some skaven, but not because they didn't want to, because they're still a patriot, they didn't want to commit blasphemy, even though it's starting to sink in the character that they might have 
fucked up. They have no clue. Given that you're that uh, all contact is vetted for you, you and what is that? They have no way of actually confirming one way or another. But yeah. Which causes a weird friendship between the prisoner and, you know, prison taker and all that, but... Yeah, seems to be weirdly happy with the one thing he discovered. He seems to have recently got his doctor, right? At, uh, a university. Or, you know, correspondence. In exchange, yeah, you know, that was what he was paid for, uh... Teaching how to speak a language, and publishing a book for it for the dwarves, and publishing for a book for it, uh, humans, and it fundamentally changed so fucking much. There's not a lot more I want to touch on, but honestly, speaking, I've been feeling out of it. I just don't feel like I have the energy to actually. Keep up talking right with streaming today. So, outside that little burst I just got there, I already signing out. Uh, we'll just go longer another day. Uh, we're due even at this with how short this was. <laughs> yeah. Next time, folks.